We're talking about knowledge of the future in movies. This is the Monster Club 1981 starring Vincent Price. So I think I found something in here about a ship in the future from 2020. And it's going to be called Merlin. And I assume this is in the Royal Navy. The Navy of the United Kingdom. There have been many ships that have been named this over the years. And I think they show this uh, in many places in uh, Monster Club. If you go back and watch some other videos, they seem to be talking about warships. And uh, from the standpoint of this film that was made in uh, 1981... Many of these ships, uh, you know, weren't even on the drawing board. This is stuff that lied in the future. I, the impression that I get is this is some uh, great or significant ship in the future. M E R L I N Merlin, and uh, Merlin is a magician or a wizard, and uh, he's featured in these um, legends surrounding King Arthur, and this is from. Um, you know, the United Kingdom, uh, England. The Monster Club, they talk about future warships. They also seem to be talking about great writers and, uh, you know, and their works that were uh, produced in the United Kingdom. So Merlin, uh, you know, ticks both of these boxes. Okay, so you want to know where they show this uh, in Monster Club. Uh, here's a quick reference. And you go back to... A video I just did, it's on the apparent references in Monster Club to the movies of director M. Night Shyamalan. Now one of the movies he did, it was Lady in the Water, and this is from 2006. And right there, you got your link. If you know about the legends of King Arthur, there's this lady in the lake. And, you know, it's like that simple. Here's another one. In the opening sequence, they show this uh, plaza. There's like a storefront. And you look off here, there are uh, two horses. It says uh, Morrison, Turf Accountant. There are two horses. Okay, you have horses, you have a rider. Okay, you go back and look at my other videos where there are links in this film to King Solomon's Mines. Okay, the author of this book... From the 1800s, this was H. Ryder Haggard. All right, you have uh, and, you know this. You got to use your imagination on this. Uh, think outside the box. Okay, you got uh, H. Ryder Haggard. Okay, you have Merle Haggard. Merle Haggard. You got Merlin. All right, this is how this stuff works. It's uh, it's rather interesting. Here's another one, and it's uh, it's in the same scene. And it's the, uh, the text on the screen. Look at this. A sword and sorcery production. Uh, this describes uh, Merlin uh, pretty well.